I leave Dragapult and they leave Grimmsnarl. We're up against Hyper Offense, so Grimmsnarl is going to get up screens, everybody else is going to set up, and Garganachi is going to Salt Cure. They taunt Cinderace, so I can't Court Change, then expecting them to Parting Shot or Switch, I U-turn in and talk Specs. Unfortunately, Cinderace gets burned by Flame Body, but it's whatever as long as they don't have Substitute, and it looks like they don't, so I'm able to Toxic and Haze, and then sack Cinderace. It's a double down, and now I send out Zoroark disguised as King Gambit. Notice Supreme Overlord didn't activate. I don't expect them to Taunt, as King Gambit's Dark Typing makes it immune to Prankster moves, then I Nasty Plot twice, and I'm able to Chua KO Corviknight. And with that, depending on what their Dragapult set is, Toxpex likely can beat the rest of their team. On turn 19, I go right into Great Tusk, in case they're a physical set. Since they dropped a Draco, they're probably Choice Specs, which means it is walled by Toxpex. Out comes Garganachi, so I go right into Toxpex, who's holding the Covert Cloak. What Covert Cloak does, is protects the holder from additional effects of moves. Specifically, Salt Cure's taking damage, and Shadow Ball's chance to drop Special Defense are completely prevented. I just needed to be smart with my recovery. 